All right, hello everyone. I uh, hope you're having uh, a good time during this quarantine period. And to keep yourself a little bit more busy, um, I've prepared this little tutorial to show you how to fold an origami X-Wing, as you can see right here. Um, so let's get started. So you need a square piece of paper. A sticky note will work, although that might be a little too small because, as you can see, once we get to the end, there's some fine um, folds you need to do. So having a bigger paper will be helpful. So the beginning is actually really similar to how you fold like a standard crane. So first we're gonna fold corner to corner like this, and then we're gonna fold side to side. So this side here and this side over there. And also if you have a paper that has two colors, um, pick right now pick the color that you want to show so I'm gonna have this peach color so while I'm doing this beginning part portion the peach color is gonna be at the bottom and the white's gonna be at the top and if I wanted this to be white I would I would just do uh, peach on the bottom All right, so once you have this done, fold it again to into a triangle. Also, don't link that mistake. I did that by accident. And then you kind of, so you put your hand here and then you fold along this center crease right here. And so it should kind of open, press gently, and make sure, make sure all the folds work out. And don't force anything, just kind of, let it be. And then same thing on this side. So now, if you built a, or excuse me, if you uh, folded a bird before, like the crane I mentioned before, this is the similar thing. So then you have, so then uh, face the point towards you and have the open side, or excuse me, face the um, open side towards you and the point away from you. And take this edge right here and bring it over so this edge lines up with the center line like this. And then same thing on the other side. And it's okay if you're taking some time. A lot of this needs quite exact folding. And yeah, you do the same thing on the other side. Um, and feel free to pause the video or fast forward if you feel the need to. And then like this. All right, now open them. And then face the open side to or yeah, face the open side towards you and have the point facing out. And then bring in Bring just like you did before. Bring this edge to this edge, so they or this edge to this fold, so they should line up, and then smoothen that out and fold it in. And the same thing on this side and on the underside. And then you might need to kind of kind of work it out so that you get all the way so that it opens all the way in. And also a good way there and then this middle fold lines up in the middle. Alright, so once you have that, open it so you have uh, the open, I'm going to refer to this as the close as the close side and this has the open side. As you can see, I have the peach and the white, and then this is, there's no white here. So open it on both sides so you have an open side and then open side here. So you have, uh, where is it? So you have, so it looks kind of like this, where you have even on each side. And then now what you do on the each of the open sides is you take this bottom side and you bring it into the middle like this, so it lines up right with the center crease. 
and do that on this side. And then you fold it over and you keep and you do that. There's gonna be a lot of repetition um, since um, since the X-wing is pretty much is oh. <laughs> since the X-wing is pretty much symmetrical. And then now you have that, and then you fold it like this to get to your um, other open sides. And then now since you have two done, you can line up this edge with this back edge. And make sure from now on, or just any time, I should probably show this in the beginning, but make sure your folds are nice and clean. You can kind of just smooth it out. Because like I said, once we get to making the wings thinner and get to the, the blasters, you need some really f um, crisp folds. So then um, have it open so you have two of these sides. I'm still gonna call these the open sides. Two of them on each side, on each side. You have something like this, you have one, one. And then you fold the uh, closed side now. Um, up, so I just kind of rotated it, but I fold it up so they meet like this, and you just kind of fold that down. So that's going to be a guiding fold for our next fold. So now, so now, now you here open, open this, and then from here take the middle and you fold it up, and you'd see how I'm kind of creating a little pocket there. So then once you do that, um, push these edges, the edges into the center, which will help it. Just kind of put your finger there so you can kind of make a pocket and then go like that. And then bring this one down and then flip it around and do the same thing. So again, you take the center, pull it up. You can kind of put your finger here to make a pocket and then bring, in, bring these in and then kind of crease it here and then fold it down. Now, so now you have two opposite sides with these down. Now you can fold, fold them in like this. And these ones, we're gonna do the exact same thing, except we're not gonna do the last step, which is folding it down. So we're gonna actually gonna keep it up. One, and then two. So now you're here, have the point up and start on the on the sides with the triangle facing down. Go one, two, three, open it up. So now you see a little a this um, this angle and then this angle. Fold it up and now this is I find kind of hard is so kind of pinch pinch um, this edge. So you kind of make this and then have the bottom edge or so have have this bottom edge right here line up with um, this edge right here. And I'm gonna do that four more times. So if you get to here and you have one and the angle down here, not on the this side, but on this side, you pinch it and then you fold over the other direction. So it's basically mirrored. All right, so now I have all four of the wings and have it kind of have it like, have it so that you have two wings on each side. So this is gonna be the front of your X-Wing. So, so now we're gonna work from the back. This is where it gets tricky. So actually, let's start with the closed side. So this is the, the flat side, let's have it open there. And so now what we're gonna do, we're gonna take this edge and put it, um, this edge we're gonna fold it over to the center. But while you're doing that, 
grab uh, this corner. So you're gonna grab it here and then pull it out and you'll see this open, it's supposed to do that. So again, kinda straighten it out and then fold it, align it and then fold it. So have this fold secure and then now we're gonna take this, we're gonna pop it in so you kinda have, have it kinda have the pocket, so to speak, be on, on the same side as the shorter point and then bring this edge down to this, down to the bottom edge, like that. Again, so we're now we're gonna do it on, now we're gonna do it on this side. So again, if we're going, I'm gonna rotate it so it kind of feels the same way as this. So now you take the, um, uh, this edge, line it up, and then these two points should meet and then Pop it in, and there you go, just like that. And try to make it exact as possible because when we do the uh, the uh, the blasters on the edges of the wings, having this whole pocket, having this whole pocket be there and making it consistent is is um, is a lot easier. So then you flip it around and do the same thing. So now you have all four, all four of these sides now. Now from here, fold it, so have it like this, and then fold it like so. So bring the top two down and the bottom two over. So now we're working with this, hold on. Okay, I think I forgot to bring this one up. Um, but yeah, there we go. And then now this side, now with this one, it's going to be a little bit harder. We're going to do the same thing, but it's going to be a little bit harder because we have a fold already right here. And then bring it here, and this is going to be a little bit harder. So kind of pull from the corner again so that it's firm here. And then create that pocket again. And then fold it down. Same on this side. So again, bring it bring the corner and bring it down like this. And then flip it around and do the same thing. All right, so now you have the uh, the wings almost done. Now what, now what we're gonna do with this, these bits at the end, so open it Again, so you have the original side you did first, and then fold them up straight up so the center of this should line up with this. Flip it around, do it again, and then now to hide that, we're gonna fold it, we're gonna fold it back around, and then we're almost done. Now open. Now to get the blasters, now open each wing and then, and so what we're gonna do is push it in like this and you should kind of, and you kind of see, I'm trying to show it. I'll see this side, this one I did a little bit better. So we're gonna open it and then we're gonna bring this corner back at the same time we're gonna kind of make a little pocket almost in there and then just kind of smush it. And there, those are the blasters. And there you go, there's your origami X-Wing. You should make a bunch of these. You can make a whole squadron and you can defend the galaxy.